Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It is Expresso <laughs> right here on SABC3. Well, you know what? what? When, when it comes to getting away, I've been thinking about different things that I'd like to do. Just, you know, get away from everything. What could one possibly get into? Well, you're going to not need, just need to get away from everything. You're going to need a whole lot of money to, to get what is up oh. next. When it comes to getting out of a big city and hitting the high seas, there's nothing quite like sailing. But it's safe to say that nothing comes close to what designers are calling a floating island. Yes, what? believe it or not, a new concept that is an 80 meter tall private floating island that also sails uh -uh. now there's a whole lot of these uh, things on here Lee, and that you can buy uh, a floating island that's door dropping designs it features a waterfall shark feeding station a helipad and then why wouldn't you underwater dining saloons Stop two it. beach clubs yes aspects of the island that you might look at they, they, they say that they make it look like a flashy oil rig but it features luxurious penthouses mm. two elevators there's a jacuzzi a glass bottom it doesn't go very fast a glass though. bottom yes wow so that means like a chip off a rock at the bottom of the ocean and like yeah trouble. but maybe it's just like really thick glass <laughs> really i'm just thick saying glass. the titanic said too you know they said that <laughs> this is and titanic wasn't built in 2015. Okay. uh eight knots though that's how fast it goes so chilled. Very yeah chilled. very chilled yeah. so to get around there is a submarine so that you can go a lot faster of course why yeah. wouldn't there be a submarine <laughs> okay. the vessel is yet to be given a price tag so for all of you out there that wants to buy your wife something really expensive oh. uh it still needs a so price basically tag, so. they say only bill gates could like use this what do you mean so, like or yeah, someone I, in south africa you ain't gonna be able to go anytime soon what you talking about i could do that you know for <laughs> bait i do anything for bait right okay so the floating <laughs> island will be showcased yeah you can go to the monaco yacht yacht show this week Katlejo, seeing that mm, you have the yes. cash to buy this of course uh, mm. yes uh, and you can check it out to see Come if along. you can purchase it uh, mm. no no thank you all right you're married it's cool <laughs> What are you talking wow. about? I feel, I feel like I have to work so much harder I know, now I feel in like my I life. I have to run away. I feel almost worthless now that no, I see this. No, don't feel worthless. Hey? hey, but the question is, if you had all the money in the world, like Atlejo Mabue, what would you buy? Like, what would you use your money? What would you buy, Atlejo Mabue? You know, when you, you descend from African royalty, you, uh, these things are possible. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I, would you I'm buy that float? I wouldn't. If I had the money in the world, I, I would try some way, uh, find some way of, of feeding hungry people. That's what I would do. Okay, that's great. But if you had all the money in the world and you could buy something, what would you buy? Oh, wow. Yo, I'd buy a life, eh? Like a whole lifetime of me again. Just like, I'd want to live forever. Really? Basically. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's Boring. a very... <laughs> <laughs>